Hello, this is Hawker to Bean, and today we are going to be reading an SAP thingy called Anderson's Robotics Installation and Guide, your new Butio series mechanical exoskeleton. This might seem a little bit random, but if you well, or if you remember what playlist we're in right now, this is going to be the end of death canon. Continuing from where we left off, but not quite going to the main plot again yet. As the next thing was the epilogue of season 2. So, we are on one of the side tangents for the, e the end of death canon. And I know, this is quite, we're quite literally bringing back some that I kind of forgot about, and uh, stopped doing forever ago. But hey, I decided why not? I've got time. And it really feels wrong to not finish what I start. You know, if you like this video, please like on the video, comment down below, and subscribe to the channel. Now let's get right into this. Anderson Robotics Installation Guide, your new Butio series is Mechanical Exoskeleton. Thank you for purchasing the Butio series Mechanical Exoskeleton. To walk you through installation, usage, and safety precautions, please welcome our feathery friend, Finn the Falcon. Hi, I'm your I'm Finn the Falcon, your feathery friend from Anderson Robotics. I'm here to teach you all about your new purchase. The Butio series mechanical exoskeleton. With old age becoming a growing problem, you made the right decision to get out of your impermanent, organic body to switch to one that will keep you looking young, strong, and healthy forever. Features! Our product has a wide variety of features to give you all the feeling of a real body and the safety of, of a near indestructible exosuit. Customizable appearance! Thanks to our collaborative efforts with Prometheus Labs, the material from, on which you'll be constructed will feel just like the real thing. You'll experience true comfort in your new body, being able to be who you want to be. Change all sorts of things about you whenever you want. For example, you won't have to worry about a haircut because you can simply will your hair to grow. It can be up to three feet long and a short that's completely bald. Simply think about the hairstyle you want and the Butio o series mechanical exoskeleton will grow or cut your hair for you. Additional old customizations are included too, such as eye color, height, build, and even sex, should you feel like taking a different gender for a spin. Which is great for those of us who would willingly touch that gender changing rock. Got the number, but you know the rock I'm I'm referencing. Anyway, reinforced plating. Of course, making a vessel that could easily be destroyed or worn down would defeat the point of being in a robotic body. To avoid this, the plating has been enhanced to super resistant to be super resistant to the wear and tear of not only daily life but even more extreme situations too. Ever felt like skydiving? This exoskeleton can withstand a fall from um, 15,000 feet, so you won't need to worry about a parachute. It's even got temperature regulation, so you can take a pleasant and trip for the, to the harsh volcanoes of Hawaii or the frigid landscapes of Antarctica. It'll enable you to do anything you want to without fear. Realistic sensations. Just walking around feeling numb isn't going to be the way you'd want to live the rest of your life, so make sure to add in a way to feel to truly feel human. All sensations work, and we can turn earned on and off for certain body parts. Using discrete dials within your new body. Sight can be magnified, smells and tastes can become more enhanced, sounds can become clearer, and you can just forget about how sensitive you who can't make your sense of touch. 
Please do not go beyond level 3 sensitivity for touch and taste without your doctor's permission. Hang on, there's one I missed apparently. Oh, here it is. If you experience fire dysphoria, do not change your gender without your doctor's permission. Don't tell me what to do. I'm going to change and, and, and it. Anyway, where are we? Finally, there's the one thing people have been hoping for a sleep function. Once you activate your exoskeleton and, and specific key e code, you can fall asleep for as long as you like. There will be an, ev oh, even be an option to wake you up from an outsider's perspective. In case you need to get off your lazy circuits and do something with your life. Oh, that would suck. Adaptive oxidizer. To top it all off, you don't even need to worry about eating or about breathing or eating or any other kind of refueling with this product. The exoskeleton can absorb carbon dioxide in the atmosphere uses it to keep your brain healthy, preventing memory loss to the goal of unaugmented individuals reaching old age. Heck, it can even gather oxygen out of water, making it possible to, for you to take a pleasant stroll on the ocean floor. The possibilities are endless. Wait, so that means that with this, you could literally travel anywhere for free if you really wanted to. Insulation! Be careful here. Fortunately, you don't have to worry about insulation with this product. Bootsia O-Series Mechanical Exoskeletons are custom made for customer, and careful o surgical operations are done in order to install their brains into the new system. However, you will need to go through a series of tests to ensure that there wasn't a mistake in the operation or a flaw in the construction of the product. Sight test! One of the first sensations you will feel after being installed in your Butio series is mechanical exoskeleton is sight! If you are conscious and cannot see, please attempt to alert your doctor for their mate if and mere malfunction in surgery or construction of the product. This test is necessary as sight is one of the most requested things that people want in their new body. What would eyesight almost always fading to near uselessness once you hit 100? <sighs> Motion test. If for any reason you are unable to move a body part after installation, stay still and attempt to focus on moving that particular body part. Certain body parts may require this process as the adaptation from organic to mechanical muscles may need a jump start. Should the problem persist beyond this, please alert your doctor. While your body may be able to move fine, be sure to regularly test your limbs every two months to make sure or if any repairs or replacements need to be made. Speech test. Attempt to make basic sounds with your new mouth before trying to form sentences. Your girl, your work. Yeah, I can't uh, talk apparently. Anyway, work your way from vowel sounds to simple words to familiar yourself with the process. If you cannot recognize the sounds coming out of your mouth as words, please alert your doctor as there has been a language recognition error during the surgery. This test is not necessarily needed for people who are born mute, as learning to speak without an impediment takes consistently more time. However, communication is key for most other people. Sensory tests. Beyond sight, you will need to test if hearing, touch, smell, and taste are also functional in your new Butio series mechanical exoskeleton. Attempt to differentiate between different sensations using your new body. And should any of them feel diluted or non-existent, it may be caused by your sensations beginning on lower settings. Should the problem persist after increasing the sensitivity of the product, please alert your doctor. This test is also is especially crucial for those who or special custom um, sensitivity settings such as enhanced sight or hearing. Proper usage. With basic tests out of the way, you'll need to know all about the proper usage of your new body now that you're in it. This part is most simple, though, oh, it still needs a little explaining. Put plainly, live your life! Be careful the first few months that you're wearing your new Ubadi. Don't go skydiving or water walking or rapidly changing your appearance to the moment and that you get it figured out. Go into your new life carefully at first. You need to watch for certain bugs that might have shown that might not have shown up in the initial test. Or in the worst case scenario, a part needs to be replaced. Be sure to contact your doctor or order a replacement part because being without an arm or a leg could be an uncomfortable way to get around and buy it's supposed to be an improvement over your old life.
once you're comfortable with your new body, feel free to start getting more extreme with your doctor's explicit permission. This is a point where you can start art becoming a stunt driver or a brave explorer or just stay in the more calm life you were in before. What do you do with your new life is up to you. And with the Butio series of mechanical exoskeleton, your life is the least of your worries from now on. I mean, your life was never going to end anyway. Warnings! The following is a list of prohibitions once you are installed into your new Butio series mechanical exoskeleton. Please read and follow this list. 1. Do not leave Earth's atmosphere. The Butio series mechanical exoskeleton is unfit for space travel at the current time. As the frog itself has gone has been prone to disassembling in certain low gravity scenarios. Do not expose your exoskeleton to hazardous materials. Do not expose your exoskeleton to hazardous materials for prolonged long periods of time without proper equipment. Certain corrosive or extreme temperature or substances have been seen to irreparably destroy mechanical nerve endings. With the Butio series mechanical or exoskeleton and if in contact for too long. If necessary, handle the edge materials with extreme caution and proper supplies. Do not remove your brain from your new exoskeleton. The surgical process to install a brain into a Butio series mechanical exoskeleton renders the brain non-functional if removed and cannot be reinstalled into an exoskeleton or new body for yada removal. Do not do any other activities that exceed your assigned dopamine limit. Do not produce quantities of dopamine that exceed the limits stated by your doctor. Dopamine and other similar hormones are known to interfere with the connection between the Butio series mechanical exoskeleton and your brain. Avoid the activities that cause increase of your meaning production. Such activities include eating particularly indulgent food, am I struggling off? Listening to loud music, my metal, or recreational drug use, my estrogen. No, wait, that, that doesn't count. Should you know signs of sluggishness or difficulty with senses while participating in an enjoyable activity, please stop enjoying yourself. Wow! <laughs> Don't enjoy yourself. Do not finish! Whether self-induced or induced by a partner, finishing is one of the most common exceeders of the Butio series mechanical exoskeleton and self-mean limits. Unless given explicit permission by your doctor, lewd things, things or self-pleasure or, or, or is extremely dangerous. If you wish to have children, please be sure to store a suitable amount of eggs or sperm before your upcoming surgery. Should any of these warnings be ignored, Ederson Robotics is not liable for any arable air, damage to your or Butio series mechanical exoskeleton. Final words. With all this in mind, please enjoy your product and enjoy your new life. Anderson Robotics, thanks to you for all your purchase. I've been Finn the Falcon, and I hope you have a better future today. Your surgery is scheduled for, fir for the 1st of September, 2130. Oh dear. <laughs> the old saying, if it sounds too good to be true, it usually is. Well, it certainly rings in, in true here because I'm not willing to give up Stroganoff for a robot body. Even if I get to. Even if it. Even in a world where you get to be 130 years old with no signs of. of of dying. Anyway, um, that was an installation guide for a robotic body that Anderson Robotics 
sorry to produce in the is um canon where that just isn't a thing anymore if you like this video please would like on the video comment down below and subscribe to the channel i have no idea what i'm going to do tomorrow so until then goodbye